This bow tie, he came to me from a hoarding environment. I love special needs cats and he came from a 50 cat hoarding environment. He was declared the worst of the worst. So I said, that's the guy for me. He's missing an ear. He's missing his tail. He had 26 of his 30 teeth pulled because they were rotted. He had multiple um, parasites. He had was an, on several antibiotics and he could not walk in any four of his legs. It was determined that he had unexplained lameness, but by the time I got him, I tried to work out his lameness. And after he got finished his bi antibiotics, he, he started to walk. So today he can walk. He was also missing a lot of his hair and he was a bloody mess on his back. He's got good hair today, though he has a little mohawk thing going on. He became the spokes cat for special needs, so he works. I take him places with me and he speaks about special needs and that special needs guys like this are special and they deserve homes. He is working for the Giving Challenge, so he's wearing his bow tie with the dollar bills, hundred dollar bills, so hundred dollars and a real silver dollar. So bow tie is going to be working the streets at least for the next month, gearing up everyone to give to the Giving Challenge. Yeah. Bowtie spent seven years of his life in a hoarding environment. He ate bugs off the floor if he ate at all. He was inbred. His mother is his aunt, is his sister, is his daughter. Uh, it's a terrible, terrible environment for cats. He deserves his seven years to count for something. And that's why he's become a special needs advocate. So we want Bowtie's first seven years to be worth something. And to make it worth something is to make his next seven years matter. So giving will matter. They need help. And your dollars, Bowtie will put his dollar into, will help.